consequence of uh, colonization. Hello. Uh, so I have class and I'm painting, I'm working on this new painting. It's, it's kind of more difficult than I thought, I won't lie. This painting is gonna be falling in love with my culture, getting to know my culture. And with this, I'm working with a sound design that you'll even be seeing. What I love about this is that I can watch class and things. And people don't get like that's what I loved about COVID. That's what I I know a lot of people are gonna be a lot of people are gonna get like offended, but I loved the pandemic because I could multitask, like paint and watch class. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead continue watching class and paint, and see you in a bit. We're going to a dinner, right? I'm putting... <laughs> somewhere in Arabic, somewhere in English. I don't know what else I should tell you, or like, should I tell you anything, or should you just like experience yeah. everything? Experience it, and then we talk about it. Okay. Have you been? Like, my heart is going to go to the house. I'm 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 going to go to the house. وكل شيء وان شاء الله الله يوفقك ويضل كل شيء ماشي بخير وسلامه انت واهلك وكلكم وليك حبيبي نحن كثير اشتقنا لك يا قلبي وان شاء الله نرجع نشوف بعضنا يا رب ما بعرف حتى يخلص هال اخبار هالبلد مسؤولة بس هلا ان شاء الله بخير ما بعرف ليش انا قلبي بضل لانه يعني بضل بضل قلبي معلق بيدي انت بحبك 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 كثير الله يوفقك ويوفقك ويوفقك
past three days here in Milan. And honestly, I'm just over it. I have a lot. Uh, I have exams this whole month. So there's a weird system here in Italy how you can retake exams from any other semester. You just have to. It's just a weird thing. Um, I don't know if other countries does that, but I know that most of them don't. But anyways, I have some exams. I'm still painting and working on that. And I'm just going to really just take it very slow today. I have an essay to write. I don't like writing essays. I don't like writing essays. And I'm just gonna work for a bit. This is gonna be my whole day. I went to the gym in the morning. Now I'm just gonna take it pretty low. It's so fucking dark outside though. It's so dark. Everything just seems so. Everything is just fucking closed, man. And I'm sick of it. I wanted to go vintage shopping, but I'm fucking sick of it. Where are we going? I don't know. No, I watched that on Monday. And I never watched it. We. Why? Don't you like musical? Yeah, I just never watched it. I don't know why. That's, that's the movie we're watching tonight. Woo! That is what we're watching, baby. It's really good. So, what I just showed you was the sound that I'm working in parallel. I, kind of, I kind of asked some questions like, what well, you guys want to know more about me? Someone just said, talk about yourself. But I'm not a person who knows how to talk about myself. So I'm just gonna go through each question. And a lot of you asked me is where I'm from. So I was born in Lebanon and I was raised in Nigeria for 12 years and I went back to Lebanon and my dad's half and as well and half Lebanese and my mom's fully Lebanese and you tell us something about your studies and living in Milan as a student so as a student I am studying visual arts that's about filming about painting it's a it's a, like it's a big part of artistic mediums that I've been experimenting with and going through it and being a student in Milan is cool but could get a little annoying if you don't know Italian and I have the best people at least and this is my third year right now and it's going it's going good it's going nice how do you know that your passion is to make art 
So I've always been a creative kid. I grew up playing a lot, creating a lot of imaginary games, imaginary stories. I started off with drawing comic books, drawing off comic books, creating comic books. And it becomes such a habit to be drawing. And finally, like how long have you been painting? Actually painting is such a baby to me. It's like, just I just started exploring with it. And it's been maybe a year. I think it's been a year of me painting. And I officially think this painting that I'm doing is my third painting that I love. The rest are just more like, out of all I did like five paintings, including the three that I love. And on like till now, this is my third. You know when you take, when, when you get a new pet and you take care of it and you like find love for it, this is it now. And came back home, it's been very cold. I just decided to sit in bed and stay warm. So I've been over thinking about the painting and it hasn't gotten where I want it to go and that's fine. Like, and you guys have seen like little glimpse of it, but I think you guys will see the video in the future, like the painting in the future when I post it. But I don't think it's gonna be part of a video anymore. I really thought I'd be done with it, but it's fine. It's fine. Like, did I get mad with the painting? Yes, and I get overwhelmed. But, you know, trying to find my identity with oil painting is is a journey, of course. That I I kind of am figuring it out, like step by step. But yeah. I was, I did present some of, I did present the kind of the painting to some exams that I had for the month and it went good, but I'm still not satisfied with it myself. That's fine. Like I'm still on the journey with creating more painting and more, but with parallel, I'm learning some sound designs and wanting to pursue that as well. And even with writing, like I'm just, getting there i'm just i'm just getting there hopefully anyways i'm gonna go back to see the painting it won't be posted here anymore yeah i'm just I just hope you like the video and i hope i'll see you in the night i hope i'll see you soon but anyways i'm just gonna say bye bye